This is the captain. This is David and Goliath. And maybe you didn't know, but the plane's version struggles for control of the civil aviation area. The front Airbus A380. In front of him is the Boeing 787 Dreamliner from the United States. At first glance, these are two very different planes. One is the largest passenger plane in the world. A titan that can carry 6,000 people and more. And the other is a medium passenger plane but economical in fuel. To represent very different concept regarding the aviation market. One of them shows us what passenger plane will look in the near future. Somewhere in the 90s, the two companies sat and thought which plane should be invented to dominate the market. Both saw huge growth in the requirement for flights and more people prefer to fly if possible than quickly and cheaply. Airbus decided to build a huge plane just like the successful Boeing 747. It was clear to hear that a large plane would not be able to land in every airport. But she calculated the jump in population size, the expected demand for flights and the conclusion that in the future there will be no choice and countries will simply increase the airports. Boeing on the other hand went in a different direction. She decided to develop a medium passenger plane that can land even in relatively small fields but his flight range will be long enough that he can fly also between continents. She bet that even if the routes that pass over the sea are full of huge planes, she will still be able to use her model for shorter flights, profit from him in every lane, and therefore chips for operate. Today the winner is quite clear. So far 1000 Dreamliner have been ordered from Boeing, but only 3000 A380 aircraft from Airbus. So why? Very simple. The small airports did not grow. Countries prefer to develop the international fields without increasing the regional fields too much, simply because there was no room. Boeing gambled and won, so much that Airbus developed a plane called A350, which is its own kind of Dreamliner. Future planes will not be a flight titans, because it's better to have a small and fuel efficient planes that can land at any airport.